Life has no agenda. It's for you to be a full-fledged life. A grasshopper is trying to be a full-fledged grasshopper, earthworm is trying to be a full-fledged earthworm, a bird is trying to be a full-fledged bird, a tree is trying to be a full-fledged tree. A human being should strive to become a full-fledged human being. These are all our businesses. But each one of us start creating our own agendas and doing all kinds of things. No, no, you're just a piece of life, don't take yourself too seriously. Because before you and me, countless number of people have come and gone. Just a little bit of time, life is a bit of a sparkle. What you call as life is a brief sparkle. The only thing that you have to do is rise and sparkle as a full-fledged life. When something is needed around us, we will do that naturally because when you're doing wonderfully well, you will do what is needed, isn't it? When you're miserable, you will be motivated. Tell me, when you're very happy, have you looked at yourself? How nice and wonderful you are, you're willing to do anything for anybody, bend backwards if necessary, you don't have to be motivated. You just have to see how this is alive to its fullest possible level right now. If it's fully alive, it will do everything that it can do, isn't it? What it cannot do, anyway it will not do. Everything that you can do, what you cannot do, perfectly okay. We must be doing what we can do. What we cannot do, it doesn't matter. What we can do must happen. For this, all that's needed is, you must understand life is a very brief spark of this. This time, don't be motivated by anything. All that you have to do is you must become a full-fledged life. If you don't love doing what you're doing, you shouldn't do it, always somebody will do it. Maybe somebody else will do this job little more joyfully than you. All you have to do is be a full-fledged life. Don't constipate yourself with too many ideas, philosophies, belief systems, stupid thoughts and emotions with which you get constipated and become less than who you are. You don't have to be as good as somebody else and you can never be because everybody is different. But you should not be less than what you can be. So you don't need motivation for this, you need aliveness. So don't motivate your children, it's not necessary. You have to see how they're joyful and alive. In this, their body and their intelligence will work at its best.